Today we continue our series called VoiceOver 101 and we're going to talk about the two finger double tap. That's coming up right now. What's up VIPs, Derek here, back with another video where it's all about helping you discover life after sight loss. On this channel we do encouragement, product reviews, life advice, how to's, and so much more. So if that sounds good to you, consider smashing that subscribe button so you don't miss another single video. Today we're going to continue talking about VoiceOver 101. Now VoiceOver is that wonderful screen reading software built right into iOS on your iPad, iPhone, iPod, and all that good stuff. And remember, this is a joint effort between my good buddy Sam from The Blind Spot and myself. You can check out Sam in the link below and find his videos on voiceover and all kinds of other great stuff. So check out Sam, he's my good buddy, and I know he'll appreciate a subscribe and maybe a like on his videos as well. Voiceover has all kinds of great gestures, swiping, tapping, all kinds of good stuff, but the two finger double tap is one of the most interesting because of what it does. So let's take a minute, let's jump in to the iPad and see what this two finger double tap is really all about. All right, so here we are on my iPad and we're gonna show this two finger double tap. Now, again, it's simply two fingers with a double tap. Now, I like to spread my fingers apart and double tap, but you can keep them together. It's just, you have to get two fingers to double tap at the same time. So the first thing you can do is with YouTube, since we're on YouTube, figure we start here, you can start and stop a YouTube video. Now this is Sam, a good buddy, doing the voice over 101. So I thought I'd show his video, and you can double tap and start it. Voice over 101. On today's show, we're getting back. To and where then you it can stop started. it. So now this one's a bit tricky because you have to be on it, and you have it has to be playing, and so on and so forth, because it interferes with the next thing that the two finger double tap can do. And let's just go out here. Actions available. Messages. So now the two finger double tap will start and stop music playing. So let's say you're listening to some music, you're jamming out, somebody comes in the room, you're like, what the heck, you gotta stop it real quick. Two finger double tap starts and stops the music. Now I'm gonna play just a couple of seconds here because this is copyrighted music, so I don't wanna get you know blasted for copyright infringement, but we'll just see what this does. Two finger double tap. And that's it, start and stop the music, start and stop. So that's pretty much the basics of start and stop the music. You can do that wherever you are, if you're in another app, if you're on the home screen, wherever you are, two finger, two finger double tap will start and stop your music. Another area where you can two finger double tap and do something is in a text field. Text message, note, something like that. And what it does is it starts dictation. Now there is a button for dictation which you can find in the double tap with one finger, but an easy way to do it is a two finger double tap. What you do is you find the text area. Note, text field is editing, word mode, insertion point at start. You heard it say text field is editing, which means it's ready to start typing. So if I two finger double tap, it'll start typing or dictation. This is a test, exclamation mark. Inserted, this is a test. And there you go. So I two finger double tapped. It started the dictation. I did say what I wanted. I two finger double tapped again to stop the dictation. And then it helped me and typed it all out for me. So dictation is a great way to get a lot of things typed quickly. And the two finger double tap will help you out with that. Now, another thing that the two finger double tap will do is if you're in FaceTime um, or if you're on your iPhone and you have a phone call, it will answer and hang up the phone call. Now I can't demonstrate that here right now because I don't have anybody to call me, but once you get somebody to give you a phone call, FaceTime or otherwise, two finger double tap will answer the phone, two finger double tap will hang the phone up. Now make sure you're getting two finger double tap because otherwise you might hit a button and so forth. So it takes some practice because sometimes you can hit it with one finger. Make sure you get those two fingers on the screen at the same time. And when you two finger double tap, it'll do a lot of things around your device that it find really, really interesting. So check it out, two finger double tap. So there you go guys, a quick look at the two finger double tap in iOS. Make sure you go out, get your iPhone, get your iPad out, check it out, see what the two finger double tap does for you. Give it some testing. I know that you'll really, really enjoy it. Don't forget to hop on over to my good buddy Sam's channel called The Blind Spot. You can find the link in the description below. Check out his voiceover 101 videos, plus his videos on all kinds of other great stuff for the VIP community. 
so I know that you'll enjoy it. Link in the description below. Hey, let me know how you're using this gesture and lots of other gestures as well in voiceover. And let me know if you have questions that you'd like answered about voiceover on the iPad, iPhone, and all kinds of good stuff like that. Leave it in the comments below. Thanks so much for watching today. If you like this video, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and make sure to smash that subscribe button so you don't miss another single video. Until next time, my name is Derek and I'll see you in the next one.